This is Kyle Harris with Beckwood Press. I wanted to give a quick introduction to the LSP and Evo style recipes that we've developed for our servo electric presses here at Beckwood. These are a departure from the traditional concept. This gives the operators a lot more flexibility in the future. Instead of just having that predefined sequence, they've got a completely customizable setup. This would be an example of that simple recipe that we just that I just described. You can see all the normal steps. Start logging, this is data capture. Do a quick move that's your fast close to go through air and get close to the tooling. Press to force, build to a force, in this example 240 tons. Hold it for some period of time and then retract to home. Where we really differentiated is allowing operators to modify the sequence as they need. If you wanted to add another step, simply add another step. So after your dwell, you want to, you know, press to position to relieve a little bit of force possibly. It's right there. You can see all of your variables and what you need to set up that move. Yeah, these are a, a segmented sequence of steps. So you can add and subtract these as you need. Here's our basic example. Come down, press to force, hold it, end. If during your process you decide that you need additional detail in your in your setup, it's quite simple to do, simply add a step. So after we're done dwelling in step four, we're gonna add, and then we're gonna say, okay, we're gonna decompress now. Aggressiveness is a unitless variable that controls how fast it happens. Then we're going to retract slightly. We'll do it fast. No reason to wait. Just select, you know, how high you want to go, how fast you want to get there. If you want to limit the force and give an acceleration for it. After you've retracted, just go back down. Press position, enter a new position. And then add another dwell step. So just like that, we modified the way the machine functions. Instead of having to call back for assistance requiring any kind of PLC update anything along those lines this is all done completely from the HMI with no special assistance from Beckwood or anyone else it gives the machines a lot more flexibility and uh, set up for future use